Hello and welcome to Sam Curtis Music. But today we're going through a tutorial on Capital Kings the Northern Sky lead. So what it is is a tune by Capital Kings. Here it is. Northern Sky is So there it was. Um, so we're going through the lead. So first things first is the rhythm of it. Now as you can see I've already typed it out because it took me a while just to figure it out. So uh, this is what I've got. <laughs> That's the main crux of the lead, really. Um, it's very, very simple, very, very good actually as well. So the first things first is we're going through the oscillator. Uh, so we'll go through the oscillators. So what I've got is I've got I've, I've got a pulse saw wave, um, P W M. Sorry, can't speak today. Um, it's full away up, full away up and the amp is pointing towards the top of the knob slider uh, with it minus 12 and 0 0.04 0 uh, pitch the next one is um, is a multiplex with it formatted with a on format uh, with the wavetable position all the way down intensity uh, just over halfway and the amp up a little bit as well uh, it's also got the pitch which is a minus 11.96 just because it gives it that differential between the two uh, I've got oscillator 3 then on just a square with it on minus one minus sorry minus bend with the wave wavetable just pointing up towards that sort of area by there. Um intensity pointing the opposite way and amp is just is about the lowest out of the three. Uh, and I've got it on normal pitch. Makes it easy. That then is going to the cutoff or filter which I've got a uh, all by all pass on it. Um, with the cut off just about there, resonance uh, just pointing up to the uh, pa the E of resonance, having that all the way up, and then I got it on a parallel of which is actually on screen. It's on screen uh, with the cut off all the way, almost all the way up to. Yeah, all the way. Resonance almost all the way down is all just a touch up. It is, and the screen which is up there. Um, we'll go through these in a minute. Um, I have modulation which is on minus twelve, uh, and then I've got on phase which is just slightly up there, and on two. So it's just pointing up to about that corner by there, and position on mine on two, sorry, and it's almost all the way down. See, there's almost all the way down, and there's that by there. Uh, no white noise because I can't hear anything in the track. Um, feedback is up, up just to in between the M and the P, where they're going from cut off around and then back, and then yeah. The next thing we've got is 
uh, on insert one we got a bit crusher now we've got it quite wet um, it's not all the way but it's just about there and then the crush is all the way up because it gives it that distortion uh, with we got a parabolic shaper Parabolic, parabolic parabolic we have a parabolic shaper with it pointing up to the D on the dry wet and all the way over to the drive this gives it a nice crunchy feel see what it sounds like without it um, on there we have a classic tube with it all the way up just to give it a distorted feel as well. with a and we got a small reverb on there um, with the size just on three quarters I think it is yeah just about three quarters a dry wet just pointing sort of just above the quarter and the same with density and color you can see that they are both it just gives it a bit more color um, and then we got EQ's we got um, a low shelf pointing a bit downwards and same with high shelf is pointing towards the H on high shelf and the low is just in the corner there um, you got boost is slightly down as well and I've left the frequency just because yeah so I'm gonna just turn everything off just because just to show you what it sounds like without anything on because this is what I, I got from the start <laughs> Next we're going to voice in. Now I've got it on unison 2 because it just gives it a bit more of a uh, you got the pitch on with it slightly only just slightly off the end and then pan position fully wide next thing I've got is I've got the Envy envelope <laughs> envelope I've got it slightly under attack so about there just on the L uh, with the level all the way up the K is pretty much down with the level halfway and release is all the way down as well uh, now I sent that to the EQs just because without them yeah, just because without them, um, it doesn't it doesn't quite fit. <laughs> so yeah, so they're on over there. So what you do is you just drag it over to this bit and just drag it down to about yeah about there. Um, same with the other two. Quite easy really. Um, I got envelope two on filter cut off one and filter cut off to the screen. I've got it. Um, it's slightly down. It's got all the settings by here. Um, quite easy really. If you know massive, obviously, then you uh, just do do what the, you just done before with these over here. 
um, dragging it all the way up and uh, yeah so so on envelope 4 we've got a bit of automation going on the attack um, so you drag this over to here and you can automate this so um, I've got it on the attack because it goes what and then on the quicker bits you want it to da -da -da -da, if that makes sense so uh, yeah so here's the automation I've got for the attack and if you watch if you watch down here it'll ch it'll change it for you and you can see how it changes <laughs> changing down there which is quite good it's very um, easy to do you can either uh, on Cubase for instance you can either just do it down here go draw it in which is quite easy really that's one so what I noticed is um, I've got an EQ here um, it's got a low pass because on the original it doesn't actually have um, that much of a bass because the bass is taking it all up. So what I did is I EQ'd it out um, to about a hun well, 191, about 200s and I boosted the top end just because um, it sounds actually nicer with it boosted in externally rather than internally. So this is what this is the original. There we go thanks very much guys i hope you enjoyed this little tutorial which i've done um please like and subscribe to the channel find me on facebook as well uh, links are in description um i will put this the massive preset app um online for you just so you can see it um download it and whatever else uh, 